we just got done uh, having another demo using uh, Unreal Engine 4 with the, the current uh, dev version of the Oculus Rift, and now I've got the HD prototype uh, version just to kind of show what Oculus looks like when it's got a full 1080p resolution. Uh, and it looks really good in Unreal Engine 4. It's a, it's a big difference. So many more detail. You can see the textures of everything much more closely. And again, walk up to that Lava Lord, and this time you'll get some pretty cool audio to go along with it. Things just look a lot more realistic. The lava flow, you can see the different striations and the magma going through here. And then we're going to walk up to a, uh, a Fire Lord. And you can see like the glowing embers beneath his skin instead of just kind of the, the rougher, you could see glowing orange in his eyes. In the other headset, obviously, when you're moving your head around, you're, it feels very real in the world, but because of the, the, the visual clarity is not as high as on this, the, the HD VR headset, it certainly is um, a much better experience. It's more, it's more immersive. I mean, you still have the same control looking around, um, but everything just looks better which certainly helps to you know make it feel like you're you're really there and in in the world awesome yeah try pulling the right trigger whoa that was you can fire it so i'm just firing off uh a um white ball of sparks basically flying around and the trail the entrails of it are trailing around behind in, in 3d space it's bouncing off walls um it looks really really good I'm back outside and I'm about to fly, do a flyby of the volcano. So first off, Nate, how do I how do I start flying? I think you should be able to just push forward if I did it right. Oh yeah. <laughs> awesome. Very easy to fly with the. It's it's oddly similar to to walking. Um, oh yeah. Now we've got just cascades of lava coming down, coming down the mountain. And, and this, yeah. this isn't a fully fleshed out part of the level. You're kind of in like debug mode now, so bear with me. But I did want you to get up sort of close to the top of the volcano because it looks pretty cool. And you oh, can yeah. actually fly inside of it, which is neat as well. So we're flying up the side of a giant mountain with all kinds of rivers of volcanoes, like the end of you know, the third Lord of the Rings, if anyone's familiar with that, you probably are. And we've got huge plumes of smoke pouring out of the top here as well. And it looks just the river of magma. It really does look incredible. Again, you can see like the different color and striations of the uh, of the magma. And now we're kind of in the top here, and the pulsing light within the cloud of smoke, kind of moving away from it here. And you can look down. It's actually. I'm pretty sure if you were afraid of heights, this would be horrifying for some people because I'm looking down and I'm, it looks like I'm several thousand feet above the base of the mountain where I started. Confirm that people with a fear of heights do indeed. Yeah, and it's like, it is, it's, it's very cool. I am Peter Pan.